what was the Battle of Normandy? The Battle of Normandy took place in France and lasted from June 1944 to August 1944. It resulted in the Allied control of Western Europe from Nazi Germany's control. Codenamed Operation Overlord, the battle began on June 6, 1944, also known as D-Day, when 156,000 American, British, and Canadian forces landed on five beaches along a 50-mile stretch of heavily fortified coast of France's Normandy region. D-Day has been called the beginning of the end of war in Europe. The Battle of D-Day. By dawn on June 6th, thousands of paratroopers and glider troops were already on the ground behind enemy lines, securing bridges and exit roads. The invasions began at 6.30 a.m. The British and Canadians overcame late opposition to capture beaches codenamed Gold, Juno, and Sword, as did the Americans at Utah Beach. U.S. forces faced heavy resistance at Omaha Beach, where they were over 2,000 American casualties. However, by day's end, approximately 156,000 Allied troops had successfully stormed Normandy's beaches. According to some estimates, more than 4,000 Allied troops lost their lives in the D-Day invasion, with thousands more wounded or missing. But less than a week later, on June 11th, the beaches were fully secured. Um, this is what the D-Day invasion looked like. Um, Hitler made only one big mistake when he built his Atlantic Wall. He forgot to put a roof on it. This quote is from a U.S. paratrooper who is pretending to attack the Atlantic Wall, defending the beaches in Normandy. Um, Alan? Yeah? Why did it say World War Eleven? I, th- I saw you write World War Eleven. Oh, no, it's W. Oh, that's just the font. <laughs> yeah. I, I hope that won't happen, Gavin. <laughs> oh, okay. So why was D-Day important? Um, by the end of August 1944, the Allies had reached Paris and was taken from the Germans. The Allies had also removed the Germans from northwestern France, which ended D-Day. The Allied forces then prepared to enter Germany, where they would meet up with Soviet troops moving in from the east. The Normandy invasion began to turn the tide against the Nazis. It prevented Hitler from sending troops from France to build up his eastern front against the advancing Soviets. On the following spring, on May 8, 1945, the Allies formally accepted the unconditional surrender of Nazi Germany. Hitler had committed suicide a week earlier on April 30th. Um, Some stats are uh, within five days of landing in Normandy, the Allies had landed 326,547 troops, 54,186 vehicles, and 104,428 tons of supplies. Over 425,000 Allied and German troops were wounded, killed, or listed as missing during the Battle of Normandy. Of these were around 200,000 Allied casualties, of which almost 53,000 were killed. Uh, There are no reliable figures for the Germans' losses, but it is estimated that there are around 200,000 killed or wounded and approximately 200,000 more taken prisoner. The end.